what are the prerequisites needed to install Eclipse Server 2013 SP1 CPU, Memory, Dex and OS Microsoft Operating System Windows Server 2012 R2 Windows Server 2012 and Windows Server 2008 R2 with Service Pack 1 Operating System Components Microsoft .NET Framework 4.5 Windows Management Framework 4.0 Remote Tools Administration Pack ADL Days for My Microsoft Action Server 2013 A Server Role Memory Mailbox for Mailbox Server Role 8 GB Minimum Client Access Server 4 GB is a minimum requirement mailbox and client access combined role 8 GB minimum edge transport 4 GB minimum disk space at least 30 GB on the drive on which you install exchange and additional 500 MB of available disk space for each unified messaging UM language pack. 200 MB of available disk space on the system drive or hard disk that store the message queue database on with at least 500 MB of free space where exchange server stores the exchange related information in active directory domain partition mail enable recipient groups and contacts related to domain level are stored Configuration partitions stores the exchange configuration information like policies, global settings, address lists, connectors and it contains the information related to forest level. Schema partitions stores the exchange specific classes and attributes. List out the purpose of running prepare schema and prepare ready switches in Exchange Server 2013. Prepare schema after running the prepare schema switch, the active directory will contain the classes and attributes required to support exchange environment. Prepare ready. After running the prepare ready switch, new container will be created to hold the details of the information from server and databases to connectors. This process also created universal security groups to manage exchange and sets appropriate permissions on object to allow them to be managed. What is the purpose of auto discover service and availability service? Auto discover service. The auto discover service does the following. Automatically configure user profile settings for out for client running Microsoft Office 2007, Outlook 2010 or Outlook 2013 as well as supported mobile phones. Provides access to exchange features for Outlook 2007, Outlook 2010 or Outlook 2013. Clients that are connected to your exchange messaging environment uses a user's email address and password to provide profile settings to Outlook 2007, Outlook 2010 or Outlook 2013 client and supported mobile phones. If the Outlook client is joined to a domain, the user domain account is used availability service the availability service is the replacement of free busy functionality responsible for making a user calendar availability visible to other users making meeting requests retrieve current free busy information from exchange 2013 mailboxes retrieve current free busy information from other exchange 2013 organizations retrieve published free busy information from public folders for mailboxes on servers that have previous version of exchange view attendee working hours show meeting time suggestions what are the dns host record required to receiving email from the internet a mail exchange mx records that contain information about which mails server the domain used to receive email what you mean by database portability database portability is a feature that enables a microsoft exchange server 2013 mailbox database to be moved to or mounted on any other mailbox server in the same organization running exchange 2013 that has databases with the same database schema version mailbox database from previous version of exchange client can't be moved 
to a mailbox server running Exchange 2013 by using database portability. Reliability is improved by removing several error for prone manual steps from the recovery process. In addition, database portability reduces the overall recovery times for various failure scenarios. Explain the list of files will be there under Exchange 2013 database folder. .edb file. A mailbox database is stored as an exchange database. .edb file. Checkpoint files. .csk keeps track of which transactional logs move into database files. Keep on check the log file entering the database in a current order. Transactional logs. Transactional log file which are write the current transactions into transactional logs. If it reaches 1 MB, it will rename the log file into e o o o o o o o o one dot log. Tem dot edb temporary database file which will process the transactional logs that are to be to write in dot edb database file. JRS reserve log files. If the size of the disk is full and you can't write any mails as transactional logs, these files will be help into action. Explain the mail flow in Exchange Server 2013. The diagram provides more details on the mail flow in Exchange Server 2013. You can see the internal and external SMTP here. That client access servers will directly redirect it, all these connections to the transport service. Then transport service is the role which will have the submission queue. It will first of all receive the uh, receive protocol is uh, yeah, SMTP receive will be here protocol agents and it will have the submission queue pickup directory and replay directory and then it will categorize and then uh, again it will queue uh, send it to delivery queue so how it is and then this is the mailbox uh, transport service <coughs> which is also running on the mailbox servers uh, this both the services running on the mailbox servers and this front end transport service is running on client access servers so this is the uh, mailbox database and the mailbox transfer service and mailbox database it's communicate with with the rpc protocol explain how message is delivered to the mailbox database in exchange 2013 in exchange 2013 after the message reaches the target mailbox server in the destination ad site the transport service avails smtp to carry the message to the mailbox after after that using rpc transport service delivers the masses to the local mailbox what action does front end transport service does front end transport service does one of the following action based on the number and type of recipient for the masses with a single mailbox recipient choose a mailbox server in the target delivery group and based on the proximity of the ad site give preference to the mail mailbox server for the masses with multiple or several mailbox recipient, it uses the first 20 recipient to select a mailbox in a closest proximity or delivery group based on a desired proximity. If the masses has no mailbox recipients, it choose a random mailbox server in a local AD site. Mention what is the function of mailbox transport submission service. Mailbox transport submission service does one of the following action based on the number and type of recipients. For the masses having only one mailbox recipient, it chooses a mailbox server in the target delivery groups and give priority to the mailbox server based on the AD site proximity. With multiple mailbox recipient, it uses first 20 recipient to choose a mailbox server in the closest delivery group based on the AD site proximity. If there is no mailbox recipient, select a mailbox server in the local delivery group. How the flow of the mail is tracked in MS Exchange 2013. To track message flow in Microsoft Exchange 2013, delivery reports are used. It is applicable for Outlook and Outlook Web only. However, message tracking logs are also helpful to know the flow of the mail.